All right, so for this video, uh, I'm going to be trying to hit the numbers at my home field of Goose Creek Airport, uh, 28 Alpha, south of Charlotte, North Carolina. Um, I'm going to be doing uh, what I think is a series uh, until I can finally hit it. So this is attempt one. I'm not going to be doing any pattern work or anything. I'm actually just flying back from, uh, from some other landing practice at a larger field that's nearby. And so uh, I'm headed back there right now. I am 5.2 nautical miles away. And I'm going to set myself up for an approach into runway 22, and uh, let's see how close to the numbers I can get. All right, so let's try to hit the numbers. It's going to be tricky. There's some trees, and the numbers are literally right at the end of the runway. Now we're a beam. Let's go ahead and throttle down. One notch flaps. This is going to be a short field landing. So I'm going to be doing three notches of flaps. Last time I did three notches. This is only my. Let me just preface by saying this is only my second time flying this aircraft in. Uh, maybe four years. Goose Creek traffic, Cherokee 97, my Bravo is clear of 2-2. Two, two. Uh, we got the downwind traffic in sight. We'll hold. Goose Creek. And last time I flew this aircraft, I popped the three three flaps, and uh, I, it, it felt like I had a parachute behind me. Came in, and I came in long, so try to do better this time. Goose Creek traffic, Cherokee 0901 is turning base for 2-2, two, two, Goose Creek. Flaps two. Drive up. We're still a little fast. No one on downwind, so it's just me. Just me and the runway. And the aircraft. Alright. We actually set up pretty good here. Let's turn final. Camden, you got to set midfield left, downwind, other aircraft. Goose Creek traffic, Cherokee 0901 is turning final for 2 2, Goose Creek. Go ahead and pop this last notch. Turn up a little bit, I'm still Hey, Camden high. traffic, just a matter of time, Mike is now three miles from the east, and we'll be approaching for a uh, mid left downwind for 2 4. Uh, other point in the pattern, where you at? All right, we're a little, a little shallow. Had a little bit of a quartering headwind here, and it messed up my base the final turn. I don't think I'll be hitting the numbers this time. All right, that was a pretty rough landing there. There was some rolling action over on the trees. So, attempt one. <laughs> did not hit the numbers. I did hit the runway, though. So that first attempt of this series to land on the numbers did not end successfully. I did not land on the numbers, obviously. Um, there was a pretty strong gust of wind that came at me from a quartering, like a quartering crosswind right there, right before I, I, I crossed over the threshold onto the runway. And so that caused me to add a little bit of power and a lot of rudder. And at that point I knew I'd missed the numbers. So that was a no-go. So hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll be able to do it next time. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye-bye.